Comfort Inn of Pittsburgh offers a cozy, welcoming room with free internet access. Enjoy the indoor pool area year-round and wake up to a complimentary breakfast every morning. When staying at the Comfort Inn, you can feel at ease knowing that your satisfaction is the most important thing to us. Saturday, September 8th, Pittsburgh State football with their home opener against the University of Central Oklahoma. And after a big win on the road last week in Tahlequah, Oklahoma, Anthony Abanoa and the Gorillas were looking to take some of that momentum into the second game of the season, and doing so in style, coming out of the tunnel sporting a new addition to their 2012 wardrobe, a blacked out helmet. Let's kick things off early in the first quarter. On their first possession, the Gorillas were getting it done on the ground, with Bryson Wilson ripping off a 35-yard run here, followed by a 17-yard rush by Abanoa to set the Gorillas up near the goal line. And a few plays later, Abanoa would connect with Bradley Argerbright in the end zone. That's the first touchdown catch of Argerbright's career, and the Gorillas lead it 7-0 early. A few drives later, the Gorillas would take a 10-0 lead after a Connor Frizzell field goal, and a three and out on the Broncos ensuing drive would take us to the end of the first quarter. And early in the second, Abanoa and the Gorillas would continue their offensive success, as Abanoa would find John Brown early in the drive, this time for a big gain of 37 yards. And a few plays later, Abanoa would keep it himself, scampering 18 yards into the end zone and giving the Gorillas a 17 to nothing lead. The Broncos would score on their next drive to make it 17 to seven, but a few drives later, the Gorillas would respond in a big way, as Bryson Wilson would take the handoff, get near the goal line, and literally hurdle over a UCO defender, into the end zone for six, drawing an enormous reaction from the sellout crowd at Carney Smith. would finish off the Broncos in the second half with Anthony Abanoa adding another rushing touchdown and Pitt State coming away with the 34-19 win, going 2-0 on the young season. For full coverage of the post-game press conference and extra on-field interviews with players not featured in the press conference, become a Gorilla Access member today.